Hi guys, so today is a Sunday, December the 9th. So I hope y'all's uh, weekend has been going okay and that your Sunday's starting out all right. And um, just realize we're getting close, guys. You know, we could very well be gone before the end of the year. You know, that that's a distinct possibility. And uh, at this point, just realize, you know, we're going to be out of here any day now and just continue doing doing the Lord's will and, um, you know, continuing down the path he has set you on. And I realize we're at the end here. You know, I truly, I don't believe we have much more time left. And I wanted to start out, um, you know, sometimes I'll get a, words here and there and usually I'll just, re- it'll be very short. You know, I'll receive a few you know, one or a few words in my mind and my thoughts. And, I'm, and, and I'll know, I'm like, well, that's not my thoughts. You know, it's from the Holy Spirit. So sometimes I'll get that. And usually, pretty much mostly it's in, um, you know, when I'm laying in bed, either in the middle of the night or in the morning, you know, sometimes kind of drowsy, but but usually, you know, awake and um, fully awake, but maybe slightly drowsy. And, um, and I did um, a few days ago, I, I was, yeah, I was laying in bed and what, what I, what, what came into my mind was, um, the words, um, it was like at, the words at least two weeks left, something like, yeah, it was like at least two weeks left. Um, and, um, and I was like, well, that's not, you know, that's not too, I don't know how helpful that is at least two weeks left, um, you know, that's, you know, I took it as we have at least two more weeks to go through, um, which is not really specific or that helpful. But the interesting thing was I had that on, I believe it was December 6th, two weeks from the 6th brings you to December 20th, the day before the winter solstice, which is the beginning of winter, which is, uh, it should be on December 21st. And so, so I'm wondering if the Lord's saying, we just, we got to get through fall. We got to get through fall. We got to get through, we got to get to the 21st. And then I wonder if he could be indicating, you know, we leave in winter, you know, once winter starts. Um, so maybe that's what the at least two weeks left means. And, um, and then also this morning, um, I, I, I received another few words in my, um, in my mind, in my thoughts. And, and, um, and actually before, before I go into that, but it, it, a few days, it was on a Friday. I, um, you know, I had to re- return some items to Walmart and uh, a couple separate returns. And one of the returns was a, uh, a, a box of red, uh, Christmas tree ornaments. Um, a small box of Christmas tree ornaments and, um, and um, it was crazy the wait at the Walmart line. It was horrible. You know, it was very slow and inefficient, and in the in the line was just long, and it was taking forever. And but for some reason, this morning, you know, while I was laying in bed, it just popped in my mind about the return in the Christmas tree ornaments. You know, in the Walmart line that I had done on um, you know Friday, returning those ornaments, and and as I was thinking about that, the words that came into my thoughts were, um, this, this will be the end of it. I believe that's what I, what came into my thoughts. This will be the end of it. And so I knew right there that was in reference to Christmas. The Lord was pointing to Christmas. And I believe he's could be saying, this is our final Christmas. You know, this is, this is, this is looking like our final Christmas. If we even make it to it to this Christmas because this this is the end of it you know that's what came to my thoughts as I was thinking back on the return in the Christmas tree ornaments that that could also indicate potentially us even being gone before Christmas because that would basically end this upcoming Christmas and make it um you know, that that would ruin this upcoming Christmas, you know, no one, people wouldn't be celebrating it if the rapture occurs right before Christmas. 
So it could also indicate that, you know, or the Lord saying this is our last Christmas. And and it was really weird. Like, you know, usually when, when I'll have stuff come into my mind, I'll know it's not my own thoughts like that. I'm like, why would I, why would that come into my thoughts? You know, I was just thinking all of a sudden the, 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 you know, returning the Christmas tree ornaments to Walmart popped into my mind. And then all of a sudden that, that statement came into my thoughts. I'm like, well, why would I think that? Um, so those are a couple of, you know, short words I received the last recently. Um, I don't get them too often. It's, it's very occasionally and you pretty much when I'm in bed, you know, in the middle of the night awake or in the morning. And, and then lastly, I want to share, I did have a dream. It, it was roughly, or it's probably around a week or two weeks ago. And I believe it's connecting to this time frame now. Also, um, I was on in the dream. I was on my, um, former college campus, the college I graduated from. I graduated back in the spring and, um, but I was on the college campus and I, uh, and it was like dark outside. And I think there was some bird or something flying in the air. I think something was flying in the air. There was, there were some people around, um, and it was like dark outside. I believe maybe the sun was kind of setting. It was getting dark. And then I saw people in graduation gowns, you know, like they had just graduated with the, you know, the cap and gown, like they had just graduated and they were, um, you know, several people. And then all of a sudden I started running. Like I knew it was time to leave. I ran, 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 started running very fast to, 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 I was going to go to my car and because I knew it was time to leave, you know, go home, leave, leave. And I got to the car and it turned out it was my dad's car, not my car, which was interesting, um, which I believe represents the rapture is it was my dad's car. Um, and and I, I was, you know, I wanted to leave. I knew it was time to leave. And, but then I noticed the, the tire, the, uh, one of the rear, um, tires was flat. Um, I wonder it might've even been mangled, like almost if it had been damaged in like a wreck or something, but, but the tire was definitely flat, not dry, you know, not drivable. And I knew, um, we needed to replace it before we could leave. Um, and, and I think maybe my dad appeared in the dream at that point. Like, I don't know if I was going to help him or what, but, but it's like, I knew it's like, we couldn't leave, you know, we got to replace a flat tire and then we can leave. And that's where the dream ended. And, um, I believe it could tie into the time frame now, guys, because in the dream, I didn't have a graduation gown on, um, because I gradu- graduated back in the spring, um, so I don't believe the Lord's pointing to the, the spring graduation. So if it was that, you know, he would be pointing to this upcoming May. If he was doing that, I believe in the dream, I would have had a graduation gown on since I had graduated back in uh, May. So since I didn't have that on, I didn't have any graduation gown on. I believe the people with the graduation gown indicates right now fall fall commencement is going on right now. Um, and for my university, it's um right around December 20th time frame, a few days before, a couple days after, right in that time frame around December 20th, you know, 18, 19, all, all in that time frame. Um, right there. So right, you know, right in that time frame where, you know, winter solstice. And so I believe the Lord is pointing to the time frame now. And it was getting dark out. I believe that just, you know, the sun set in time short. We're out of time. And, and so then when I was running, 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 that's obviously we're getting ready to leave. You know, I was full on sprint. There were a lot of people, I think, just nonchalantly walking around. That's the people who are asleep, not aware the rapture is getting ready to happen. I get to the car. I realize it's my dad's car. I believe that represents, you know, the Lord. He's going to rapture us out of here. You know, that's probably why it was my dad's car. And then the, the will was flat. That, you know, that could, re- I think, represent everything's about to go down. The air's out of the tire. You know, it's flat. Time has run out. The air's out. Time has run out. Um, We're getting ready to leave. And I I believe that could even represent a sort of, it could be a time frame delay. Like I'm wondering if that single tire could represent like a week or possibly even a month. Because if you go a month after that December 
21st time frame. That brings you to January 21st, which is the blood moon. So I'm wondering if it ties into that. Um, um, but I believe it's connecting to the, the fall commencement going on. You know, that's going on, going to be coming up soon. And for my university, it's, it's right in that December 20th time frame, right around there. And, you know, that's why those people have those graduation gowns on, I believe. It's time indicator, I believe. So we're pretty much there, guys. I wanted to share that. Let me know if y'all have any input. And um, just keep watch. Stay encouraged. Try to stay positive and realize that time is short. Uh, you know, I don't, I don't believe we have much more time left. The Lord's getting ready to snatch us up out of here. And so I look forward to meeting each and every one of y'all very soon. And um, hope y'all have a good day. Uh, God bless in the name of Jesus Christ.